Hello. Hello. Thanks for being an inspiration. Um, my question is, when you, if you ever get a creative rut, what do you do to get out of it? How do you get inspired? I only really experienced that one time in my life, and <laughs> and uh, what did I do to get out of it? Therapy, <laughs> <laughs> medication. Uh, no, seriously. Uh, I went into uh, a deep clinical depression in the late 90s because I won't get into all the details, but my, my career kind of spiraled down. And that hit me. I wasn't really equipped to cope very well with that. So that you know, landed me in a, in a depression that I had, I had no thought of music for about five months. And that is really, really odd for me. I grew up, every, ever since I was a kid, music was such a big part. But I'll tell you what brought me out. The power of music, my friend showed up at my, at my door with a pair of drumsticks one day. And this, this, was, this was in the middle of my deep depression. I didn't want to hear anything about music. You know, and he, and, and he said, uh, 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 let's go into your studio. Now, I hadn't opened the door to my studio in five months at that point. And I said, uh, why would we do that? And he said, well, let's just go in. Let's just go in and fire your stuff up. And, and, and I really did not. And in fact, I got pissed off at him. I said, you know, you're, you're pushing me here. I don't want to do it. He says, I know you don't, but let's go back. And he wouldn't take no for an answer. So we opened the door to my studio, and I fired my stuff up for the first time in five months just to appease this guy. You know, just to, okay, we're going to do this for a couple minutes, and I'll get him out of here, and I'll be, I can go back to bed, for God's sake, you know. Um, so he sat down at the drums, he's a drummer, and he started to play. And I thought, okay, I sat down at the keyboard and I just kind of hit the keys, and it was so foreign to me. This was the first time in five months. Well, about 15 minutes later, I found myself getting into it and enjoying it. And literally a half hour later, I was so happy and I was so glad that he had done that for me, that that is the power of music. So. That's the only creative time. The only cre the time I had a creative block, and and that's what helped me out. And that's a good friend too. A great friend, absolutely. So, the other question I had. The other question I had was, you were talking about how you feel kind of disappointed about being written out of certain projects. So, how do you keep yourself up after something like that, hearing such devastating news? This. 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 Thank you. You know, I mean, really, um, anytime I've gotten really depressed about, you know, being cut out of something or being rejected or not being considered for something, I would get a Facebook message or an email from a fan saying, you know, just wanted to thank you for keeping, you know, keeping going, um, continuing on in spite of whatever is going on with your business part of your career. And that lifts me up every time. I'm not kidding you, it really does. And it gives me the strength to, to keep going on and not give up. Awesome, thank you. Well.